Seven local veterans facing substance abuse and legal problems take a very big step today toward turning their lives around. They're the latest graduates of Hamilton County's Veteran Treatment Court. Local 12's Larry Davis was there today for what was one of the biggest days of their lives. It was a show of support for local veterans whose lives took the wrong turn after serving their country. The seven graduates of the Veterans Court encountered drug and alcohol problems. Vets like Katherine Turner went through a recovery program to get on the right track. I really limited my world um, when I got out of the military and I started drinking heavily. Um, I just couldn't quiet the noise in my head, you know, no amount of alcohol was working. Um, and I suffered consequences for that. The court has a treatment team of mentors volunteering their support for people like Army veteran Sam Campbell. They gave me all the support and dignity and structure that I needed to get back on my feet again. Hamilton County Municipal Court Judge Melissa Powers started the Veterans Court in 2012. She says this is the community's way to offer veterans a hand up, not a hand out. To watch the transformation of these men and women face their issues and work on self-improvement and then to see where they were and where they end up at the graduation is just, it is an amazing transformation. I feel great today. I feel great today. And I would, I would, I would advise any soldier that goes in a, a courtroom, call the vet court and hope that they're there so that they can get some help. Now that they have made it through the program, these graduates must stay drug free, stay sober and stay out of trouble. The recidivism rate for these classes is 7% and this class hopes to bring that number even lower. At the Hamilton County Courthouse, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. Good story, Larry. Thanks very much. During the program, veterans must meet with the VA doctors, attend Alcoholics Anonymous classes as well as therapy sessions.